See, all right, so first and foremost, we want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bashemi, Oshai, Bashemi, Kakodash. We see them on the apostles and elders of great mercy on the world. Our teachers, our apostles, and the truth. And we see salutations, all the archimons, the pushing on the truth, and the in and the out. They know constantly in season and season, we see Shalom. You know, once again, going go into some, um, some scriptures here, and it's basically going to this image here, as you can see. But the title, it says, Dwayne Wade speaks on why he doesn't believe a husband should lead in a marriage. Now, this. Just, just by the, just by the headlines here in this image, you can see it's, it's this, this is what it is in this society. What they want is to make a, um, what they want is like equal, or no, no, heavily is that the worthy woman in charge, right? And that, that's basically what's going on right now is that the woman in charge. So what he said here was Dwayne Wade speaks on why he doesn't believe a husband should lead in, in, in a marriage. Dwayne Wade. Being really, you say, I do not lead in my marriage with Gabriel Union. No, when you watch Dwayne Wade's family, right, you can literally see that as a woman um, leading us also because there's nothing right. <laughs> there's nothing right. He has a son that's gone, basically finished, you know, and all that stuff, you know, Dwayne Wade himself wears on skirts, his wife, his, his wife, you know, speaks things outright. About certain stuff, you know, you can't even control and all this stuff. stuff. And this this relationship, meant, and just like plenty others that you see, like for example, Will Smith and so forth, you see when the woman is in charge. You see that there's nothing right in the relationship. There's nothing right in the marriage. Right? Now I'm going to go into a scripture here. This is um First Corinthians chapter um chapter eleven, or from verse one. He said, be ye followers of me, even as I also am Mashiach. Now, in the churches, Christianity, Catholics, whatever denomination it is, they're still, you know, equal. Yeah, 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 by, by way, why say, you know, all this other stuff. But, but that is far, 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 far away from the truth. The scripture still here, it said, be ye followers of me, even as I also am of Mashiach. It says, now I, now, now I praise you, virgin, that you remember in all things and keep the ordinances as I delivered them to you. Now, when you look at the word ordinances, right? <clears throat> Before you go down. Because he say you don't believe, but the scriptures are different. And again, this is the mindset of many people, even even the majority of these women outside there believe that they should rule you when it's not so, Right? And some of these men, they have them just an example doing with him being a great example to that. They want their wife rule them. Now, you script, hey, we, we know the, the, the prophecy say what? A woman shall come past a man. And we're seeing that, right? But nonetheless, the scripture said that a man should, should rule, right? Now, again, when you look at the word ordinances, right? Look at the meaning for ordinances. So it's, the scripture said, Now I praise you, Belgian, and ye remember me in all things, and keep the ordinances as I delivered them to you. It's an ordinance. It's a, an authoritative order. An authoritative order. So that's an order. You understand? It's a religious right. When it go on, it's a religious right. It's a... Um, it's a... An arrangement, right? Ordain. Right? So you see an an it's a an an authoritative decree or direction. You see um an authoritative decree or the or the or direction, right? So yeah, so that is what it is. It's an order, it's an authoritative decree. So when you say now I praise you, Belgian, that you remember me in all things and keep the ordinances, keep the order, right? And as I delivered them to you, they say, but I would have you know that the head of every man is Mashiach. So the head of the man is 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 the Messiah, right? And the head of the woman is the man. So the head of a woman is the man. No, there's no way you can get around it. Christianity can save you from that. Catholic, Catholics, Jehovah's Witness, whoever, whoever it is, they cannot tell you no different. The scripture said here, right? It say, and the head of the woman is a man, so it have no way a woman should be leading you. It ha there's no way that that should happen. And there are 
I've seen many comments. You've seen videos with, with people that call themselves Israelites, women that call themselves Israelites, and they basically want to be on the same level as the man. They want to be higher than the man and so forth. That is out of order. That is not the ordinance that was delivered on, onto us. That That is not the order. That is not a, the authoritative decree. You understand? The, 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 the order that was given unto us is that, but I would I would have you know that the head of every man is Mashiach. And the head of the of the woman is the man, and the head of Mashiach is God. So the head of the woman is the man. It didn't say the it didn't say the woman is the head of the man. It said the man is the head of the woman, right? There is scriptures talk about setting your house in order and all this that stuff. And show yourself as a man. Show yourself as a man. These is examples that <laughs> these men is be is, is be need the woman. So how how could they show? How could they explain? How how could they teach someone and I need them to be a man? Would it would when when they themselves are not, they have women leading the houses and and again his house is a perfect example of of how it is when a woman um leading you. It doesn't matter how much money you have, how much millions or billions you have in this place. You literally see that that his family is like a laughing stock. You know, she controls them. She's you, you see in some of the videos, she went on the pants. You know, um, um, went on the pants and playing. She the authority and so forth. And that that is what these men of today are giving these women that authority, which is something that they sh which is something that they, that they're not supposed to do. We know the scriptures say not to um thing like um be a lion in your own household and so forth. Yeah, so if you deal with them with wisdom and so forth, but they have no way. It have no way it say that the woman supposed to be over the man. So it say, but I would have you know that the head of every man is Mashiach. And the head of the woman is the man. And that is an order. Right? That day is an order. Right? So let's jump down to verse 8. It says, for, for the man is not of the... Of the woman, but the woman of the man. <laughs> right? It's said, neither was the man created for the woman, but the woman for the man. And that is the thing. We would always be that first. We, we would always be first. When it comes to woman, we would always be first. So we the head. Yahushua is the head of us. And how was the head of Yahushua? Should have no way. This, and that is just to show you the twist and everything's upside down. You understand? <laughs> they they twist everything upside down. Your whole house, all the, these things that 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 he that he did upon Jake, and Jake just loved that and they follow it. You know, you, you just see the, the 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 dysfunctional families where a woman leading. You just see it because she is not meant to lead. She's not meant to lead. I scripture says i um, knowledge and um I think it's the of your paraphrase in Job. They said knowledge and wisdom wasn't um given unto her. She don't have that. Women, women lead by what? Emotions. They don't think. You know? So you put it in she in charge. It is, again, this family is a perfect example of that. That money ain't going to save you from the shame that, 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 that going on. Your son confused out of his mind. Basically gone. You know? Transforming himself into, into be a woman. And then he with, he, he with a woman that, 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 that Pretending to be a man, it's, it's just confusion. It's just confusion doing weight comes out wearing on dresses and so forth. That madness, <laughs> that there is madness, right? Total madness. Um, let me get an scripture here quick. This is um ah. Uh, this is the book of Ephesians chapter five. Verse twenty three, right? You see here, for the for the husband is the head of, for the husband is the head of the wife. For the husband, matter of fact, let me go up a little bit. Let me go up a little bit. This is verse twenty one. It says submitting. It say, it say, Ephesians chapter five verse twenty one. It says submitting yourselves one to another with the fear of God. Right? You say, wives, submit yourselves unto your own husbands as unto the Lord. So, let's look up the word submit. Right? Submit. Submit meaning 
quick Google search. For anybody that watching on is Google, uh, Google majority of things a quick Google search are doing on, on the meaning meaning of the words, right? Unless I'm doing a video where I'll show the concordance and so forth. Right? But it says submit. Let's say accept or yield. Accept or yield to a superior force to the authority or will of another person. Superior force. So who that is what the man is. The man is the superior force. So you see the importance of looking up words. So when the scriptures say here, wives, submit yourselves unto your own husbands. Submit, yield to your, your superior force. It's the same way we would, um, um, the Lord. It's the same way we would. The same way we submit to ourselves to the Lord. We submit to our superior force. You all start to submit to us. But again, in today's society, that change. You know, now, now the woman leading. Now, as you can see, these men, they simping. You know, having a woman controlling them and so on. So the, the whole thing twists upside down. Right? Some confused. Other children confused. You know? I also said that, I also said that craziness. I also said that sin. Right? So it say, wives, um, this one, go back, go, going back into the word submit, it say accept or yield to a superior force or to the authority or will of another person or or to the authority so that means a man is authority over you you understand right it's a um let's say subject to particular process treatment or condition right that next meaning right um right it's a, um, it's a, when you go back to the old English, this means to be under, under, under. So you're under us. It have no way you all could be above us. You're under us. And that even goes for these women that coming in, coming in, calling themselves Hebrew Israelites and feel like a tell the man or feel like a leader man. That's not supposed to be. And for the men, stop making these women lead all here. Stop making these women tell all the things. Just because the, the, the sex or whatever it is must be sweet to, 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 to happy hold mine, you understand? Them spirits that are plague here. <laughs> no you know your wife how you're falling off, your wife, you know? We've seen it. Right? I say wives submit yourselves unto your own unto your own husbands as unto the Lord. Right? You're under us. We is a superior force, right? Let's see, verse 23, it says, For the husband is the head of the wife. Is the head of the wife. So he's supposed to take lead. He's supposed to be in charge. It's the same way a woman has certain things to do. Let's take a pause. All right, so like so for that, um, so yeah, so you see, um, you see, for, for the husband is the head of the wife, even as Mashiach is the head of the church. And he is the savior of the body. You know, son? Hey, especially the time I be coming in too. You better have a strong man who could lead. You know, son? The time that we coming in too, you better have a strong husband who could lead. Because it's scripture talk about a man who could be recovering from the wind. You know, son? And there's a man who could lead. There's a man who could be a, what, a superior force. Not these men who simply not feel, you know, by twisting all the things upside down, man. Everything that's in, 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 in disarray. You know, um, let's jump to our next scripture now, right? And again, I've seen some videos, um, with 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 Israelites. <laughs> men sit down with the men sit down with the with the with the with the woman with the headband up doing videos and 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 had the woman talking and then it have some videos with the woman coming out to to speak against men and all this that madness. That that is not order. And the Lord said, let us keep the ordinance. It, it, there is no order. Right? This is 1 Corinthians chapter 2. I will go to verse what, 11. It says, let the woman learn in silence with all subjection. So that's all they're supposed to learn. That's all they're supposed to be in subjection. I know the, the Lord told us how a man's supposed to be. You know how you're supposed to treat your household and so forth. You're supposed to treat your children, and there's judgment for a man that that not not lead in the right way, 
right? You say, let the woman learn in silence with all subjection, but I suffer not a woman to teach, nor to assert authority over the man, but to be in silence. So they're not even supposed to be in authority over us. So this whole statement here, this thing that he in is totally wrong. And major, and I show majority of the comments on, on, on when he said this is basically women who, the, the woman rights and, and, and me too and, and all this other stuff. Just like majority of the woman who was defending Amber Heard and now, now that it should come out that, that she's a total demon. You know, now they're trying to find all this other excuses. That is the things he has get from women. They're not supposed to lead because they do not make no good decisions. Or, or I should say that is just one of the reasons. And the main reasons the Lord t told us here that they're not supposed to be an authority over us. Right? This is um clear. So you say, but I suffer not a woman to teach nor to assert authority over the man, but to be in silence. But to be in silence. You see, for Adam was of Adam was first formed, then Eve. So he was always this is the first. Man will always just be the first, the, 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 the one. And Adam was not deceived, but the woman being deceived was in the transgression. Notwithstanding, she shall be saved in childbearing if they continue in faith and charity and holiness with sobriety. Right? Um, I don't want to shiver on the go to, but I wouldn't uh, just, paraphr just say that um, <laughs> these women are even supposed to call a man Lord. <laughs> and there is, there, there is something that I can't get, you know? There's um, same Timothy, right? I'm going to jump to verse 2. I'll start from verse 2. It says, Bishop then must be blameless, the husband of one wife, vigilant, sober, of good behavior, given to hospitality, up to teaching. I'm talking about a bishop here, right? It says, not given to wine, no striker, not greedy, not of filthy lucre, but patient, not a brawler, not, covet not covetous, one that ruled well his own house, having his children in subjection with all, all gravity. So he just assure you that, um, for if a man know not how to rule his own house, how shall he take care of the church of God? So a man supposed to be able to rule his own house. If he can't, then how are you going to do anything else? And you see it with, with these men who make women lead them, the judge, these men's judgment be off. They become like the woman. The mindset, the thinking, the movements, the way they dress and so forth, they become like the woman. <laughs> and then you no, know, the woman want to wear the pants. Figuratively, <laughs> they want to. Right? And that's something they're not supposed to. Now it's something they're not, they're not supposed to do. Right? So hey, with that, again, these women are not supposed to be in charge. Right? So with that, we give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yonshai, Ba'ashem, Rekah, Kodash. We say that our apostles and elders are great, most of the world, our apostles and shoot, and we see salutations, so they are coming to put you on truth and say, Dean and the out, you know, constantly in season, and season, we say, Shalom.